Welcome back everyone, it's Stray Fay here with another episode of Harvest Moon Animal Parade. Alright. This episode. Not sure what we're doing this episode. <laughs> Took a little bit of a break. Of course, though, technically, like episodes being published, we're not really skipping a beat otherwise. Alright, in two days, it's going to be the circus. I kind of want to get that over with. So, alright, let's start with the animals. Let us train the animals. Pyro, do your level 3 trick. Actually, do I, do I have to play through three days? <laughs> I would have to play through three days to get to the circus. Hmm. We'll, we'll try. We'll give a good, honest try. Alright, Mr. Torres <laughs> does a shake. I don't really need to train the cat because the cat's already maxed out. Um, let's check the weather for tomorrow. Weather report. <laughs> Another cold winter day with snow all day. Alright, no sunny days. I guess no sunny days allowed until... Until uh, the circus day. They always give clear days for festivals. Alright, let's get working. So I think maybe this episode, we're probably gonna be skipping a lot of befriending people and just focusing on... On just Julius and Luke, right? Because we got we got Calvin to nine hearts, so like we've technically seen all his dialogue. Oh yeah, also in the last episode we got Chase and Maya's last rival event, which means their wedding is planned. So when is their wedding planned? Please join us for this joyous occasion. The ceremony will be on day seven of spring at ten o'clock. All right, well, little, little few days after Kathy and Owens. We cordially request your company at Celesta Church to witness the beginning of our new life from Chase and Maya. Man, that was a weird... That was certainly a weird... event. <laughs> That's such a weird pairing, but at least they get to be married and they're gonna have a child, so I'm happy about that. Alright, ooh, kind of perfect onion. What am I gonna do with that? I don't know what I'm gonna do that with that, Mr. Mr. Rob Frost. Let's right, start with the animals. So I had quite a busy weekend. I I went on a little little mini vacation for my bro. Well, I technically it's like a full blown vacation. I mean, it it was three days. Not like I went abroad for like a month, but it was a nice three day vacation. We went out of town. We went to the San Diego Zoo for one day, the safari park, and then on the last day we went to Sea World. And it was really fun. We it was we were super busy like every day, and like my legs were so tired with all the walking. Couldn't even we couldn't even get through the whole entirety of the San Diego Zoo. There's just there was too much to see. That that zoo is huge. So we got through like half of it, and then we're just like had to tap out and just go home and sleep. <laughs> go back to the hotel. We slept. Like babies, we like got. I think we ate, got back at like eight, and just like slept for twelve hours. <laughs> yeah, we we're just extreme baby happening here. And then the day after that, we went to the safari park, which was very scenic, but not as large as the zoo. I mean, they had like a lot of the same animals there. Like their gimmick is that they have like this large, like area. <laughs> In addition to, like, individual animal exhibits, they also have, like, a large plane-like area where a lot of animals, a lot of herd animals can be out on, like, an African <laughs> savanna type situation. But yeah, we got to look at that. We didn't actually, like, drive up close. <laughs> like, the regular tour bus was closed. And the, like, the guided tour that you could have done, which, like, takes you right next to the animals, was, like, <laughs> the minimum was, like, $370. I'm, like, per person. I'm, like, no. <laughs> we can look at, we can just look at it from afar. It's fine. It's fine. We don't need to, we don't need to get that close. 
I'm like, seriously, who has that kind of money? Just like, can just throw like 400 bucks. Like, all right, let's go. That's nothing. <laughs> just for like a short little car ride. <laughs> yeah, could, couldn't do it. Couldn't splurge that much. We splurged on souvenirs though. I, I got a, got some shirts for the San Diego Zoo, and I got I got a pin at SeaWorld. SeaWorld is probably the most underwhelming one, even though the the animal shows were great. Got to see see the orca show. Got to see sea lions, and forgot what the third one was. <laughs> I thought we saw a third one. Brain. Brain's not working. But yeah, we saw like a few shows. And they had some animal exhibits, but I I think the biggest gimmick for SeaWorld is actually the roller coasters and like carnival games, which I kind of forgot about that they were really big on really big on carnival games. I just saw them as like kind of an aquarium type setting, but I guess not. They didn't, actually didn't have that much fish. They They had lots of penguins. And like a few turtles. Their orcas were a big attraction. And yeah, they also had a lot of sea lions. <laughs> the sea lions were funny, like you could like feed them. And yeah, they they just like go right up. <laughs> They could like go right up to the enclosure and just like open their mouth like put put fish here. <laughs> just like thinking like if any of these animals are rescued, you you cannot put these back into the wild. I know like some of the animals they they reintroduce back into the wild, but not those sea lions. I can just imagine them like going on the beach and being like, "Hey person, what's in that cup? Put it in my mouth." <laughs> Not to sound lewd or anything. Uh, Alrighty, let's milk you guys. Do -do -do. So yeah, SeaWorld is probably the most underwhelming out of all three, but that's just because none of the main attractions, I guess, the the roller coasters and the carnival games couldn't be open. So we got to see everything really quickly. <laughs> and then we're like, okay, we're done. It's like, enjoy... Enjoy some food and then go home. The long drive back. Alright, what do I want to do with this? Make cheese? Make some cheese. I guess I'll just save the other milk for whatever. I think I was going to cook something. Because I have a random strawberry and a lettuce in here. So I think... I think I was, Well, I think one of them was shortcake. I'll have to figure out what the other one was. Uh, if I do do shortcake, I will actually need butter. So I better... I better get some butter. So, don't drink it. Put it in there. Ta-da! Butter. Alright. That should be it. Y'all fine in here? I can't let you guys outside. The horse ate, right? I think I remember putting food in front of the horse on accident. It looks like it, was, it already ate. Yeah, I'm so tired and like so much walking. <laughs> I really need to do more of that though, more walking, need more exercise. Alright, there's no buckwheat to be harvested today, but there will be harvested tomorrow. Let me real quick water all the shenanigans, I'll, I'll be RB. Okie doke, all done watering here. And replenish my stamina and see what we're gonna cook today before we head over to the Garmin Mine District. Alright, so I got the strawberry. Um, I figured the lettuce, I <laughs> with the lettuce, I think I was I meant to make tacos. So that means I also have to make the tortilla for the taco. Which means I need some cornmeal. I have to do some grinding. Some grinding in the water mill. I guess it's good we grind something on on a snowy day. Get that get that bonus. Alright, so we need we actually need to make two tortillas, so we need two two corn to make two cornmeal. So let's gather that up. Do 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 
Bum bum bum. Let's see, I'll keep the eggs. I think I actually might need a I might need a all these dairy products for the cake. Alright, should I go with the good or the decent? Oh, let's just go with decent. Gonna make some good cornmeal. Is there anything else? Right, I think I'm, I was gonna make some spinach risotto for Luke, because that's worth 20, 20 points, and it's kind of easy to make as long as you have enough spinach. I just really want to get him ahead in the game. And we got we got an onion, so... Yeah, I think that just requires spinach, rice, and an onion. We got all that ingredients. All that jazz. Alright, let's go... Yeah, let's go grind that up. And we'll figure out how to make some tacos. Do, 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 do. Bum, bum. Let's see, what other things should I talk about? Um, how about my favorite animal at the zoo? <laughs> I like when I was younger, I liked all the cool animals, like, oh, the lion and the tiger, they're like big giant cats. Like, super cool. But like, <laughs> when you observe them nowadays, like, those cats are lazy. <laughs> they don't, they don't do anything, they just... They get fed, so all they have to do is just like sleep around and be lazy. They're like normal cats. Just just with the strength that can absolutely destroy you. My favorite animal at the zoo is actually the secretary bird. It was such a doofus. It, <laughs> so like the secretary bird, it's like a bird of prey, so like it's designed to hunt. But I don't think it could fly? But it has really long legs, so it, it runs really fast, like a roadrunner. <laughs> but the like the the one I saw at the zoo was just it was being silly. Like it would, it kept like curb stomping a rock, and then like the rock would like wiggle, and then it'd be like oh, boop, 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 and start like running around the enclosure all crazy, and be like. Uh, take that rock, or the, it'll go over to like this aloe bush and just like curb stomp the aloe bush. Just like take that bush and then just run around like crazy. And then eventually it started chasing its friend around <laughs> the enclosure, like putting its wings up all in the air to make itself look bigger and just like run around chasing its friend. <laughs> and the friend's like, oh no, stay away from me. It was just this really silly bird. Silly runny bird. Alright, I need to make. What do I need to make? Uh, should I make the. I should just make the cake first. Where's the cake? Uh, I need oven recipes. Yeah, what do I need? I need some wheat flour. Some decent flour. Alright, let's get bacon in that oven. I think we have all the ingredients here. We need flour, an egg, butter, milk, and strawberry. Put a little strawberry on top. Although if you're making a shortcake, I think there's there's strawberries integrated within the slice as well. Alright, shortcake was added to your recipes! Yay! Let's mark that off the list. Da da! Alright, I can I can add that. <laughs> I can add that to the collection of other short cakes that I got for for the Winter Thanksgiving Festival and ended up not needing all of them because I couldn't find all the people. Alright, so next I need to make some olive oil for the tortilla because apparently you need to fry it in oil. So let's mix up two olive oil. Boom! Got the cornmeal. We also need some salt. And I have two salt exactly, so y yippee. So what we need is a frying pan. A cornmeal. Some salt and some olive oil. Not in any particular order, just make sure it's in the frying pan. Ta 
Ta-da! That's a very, very crunchy looking tortilla. Alright, that was Adatara recipe, so let's mark that off the list. And we're gonna have to make another one, because there's, there's two recipes that require the tortilla. And olive oil, boom. Yeah, okay, Duke. Okay, Duke. Alright, tortilla done. This is a very flat looking thing. <laughs> My fingers are poking through it. Looks too crunchy to be. Too crunchy to be a. A real tortilla. Although, maybe I, maybe because I'm used to flour tortilla, which is like bleached. Bleached flour. So it's like white. Corn tortillas are probably corn looking. Alright, so the first recipe that requires a tortilla is. Pretty easy. You just. You put the tortilla back in the frying pan. <laughs> And you get, ta-da, tortilla chips with some sauce already accompanying it. Like, where did that salsa come from? I didn't, I didn't actually make the salsa. Oh yeah, I got tortilla chips. That looks delicious. I want to eat it right now. I'll probably just sell it. <laughs> I'm not gonna find who likes tortilla chips specifically. Although I guess I wouldn't hurt to check. Why not? Why the heck not tortilla chips? Tortilla chips. Does anyone absolutely love tortilla chips? No one loves them. Kathy likes them. Renee likes them. No one loves tortilla chips. What is this blasphemy? Alright, what was I doing? I was looking for the other recipe that requires a tortilla. And uh, I think it's just like a knife set recipe. Pretty much combine ingredients together. So we need the tortilla, we got the lettuce. We need a tomato. And we need an onion. And also cheese. We already have that in our bag. So with our handy dandy knife set, we're gonna chop some ingredients together. So tortilla, lettuce, tomato, onion, and cheese. Full. A full board. Ta-da! For some reason, we made one tortilla into two and made two tacos. Alright, taco was added to our recipe. Let's mark that off the list. Mmm, it's also another thing I just want to eat right now. <laughs> Give me some tacos, man. Does anyone love the taco? <laughs> it's a taco. No one loves tacos. Kathy likes tacos. A lot of people like tacos, but no one loves a taco, so... Taco, you're gonna get sold. Alright, um... I guess that's all I need, right? Let's put my other things away. And let's only grab the things that we need for... The Garmin Mine people. Do not sell the spinach risotto. Let's see, we'll also give a gift to Bo. Bo. I guess since we're seeing... Mira, we'll give her a blemist. Um, bu -bu -bum. I guess she's in Barbara too, so might as well give her that last orange juice. And I guess that's it. Not really, I will maybe Chloe. If I see Chloe, I'll give her a grape juice. But a lot of times she disappears, and I don't feel like it. I think that's it. All right, let's do what we've been doing. Should we go fishing? Yeah, let's go fishing at the pond for a little bit longer just to get enough algae to get 99 algae, and then probably the days after that, I'll I'll go fishing in the river for for rubber boots. All right, let that's the plan. We'll do that until noon, and then. We'll talk to the boys, we'll go to sleep, and we'll be able to get through another day. Do -do -do. Let's go, let's hurry up. Gotta walk it. <laughs> Gotta walk it up, Garmin Mines. Eh. At least it's a Friday and we're able to find Luke. He's not hiding in the carpenters all day. Got him a spinach risotto. So hopefully... Get him to eight hearts. <laughs> Bring against eight hearts today. Probably will. Come on, I got I got like his favorite gift. I have I have his favorite hat on. 
Stars should be aligned. Walk all the way to the goddess pond. Do 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 do. Did I pick up this herb? Why not pick up this herb? I might need it to later. Make more tea. There, we got plenty of space here. I guess I'll be right back until noon and I'll, I'll show off what I got. I mean, if I'm only just going to noon, it's not gonna take that long, so. Alright, anywho, BRB. Okie doke, it's well into the afternoon. Okay, I caught 10 pawns, smelt 11 LG. I just, I, I think I just need two more LG, right? Hmm, maybe I should have gone for a little bit longer, but I don't know, I wasn't counting, so. We're so close! Almost there! Alright, let's get to gifting the boys and their families. Their loved ones, and then we'll go, we'll go to sleep early and do it again. <laughs> do it again tomorrow! There you are, Luke. Alright, no one's going anywhere. It's a snowy day. Um, we gotta remember to give you the risotto and not the coconut cocktail. I went through extra work to get you something that gives you more points. No, get the rub. Don't eat it. <laughs> Whoa, really? How'd you know what I liked? Thank you, you made me so happy. For some reason, every day f feels happy. Just thinking about you makes me feel excited. Oh, that looks great! I have the same bandana in a different, in a different color. It's nice that we match a little. Alright, is that, was that eight or is that the same old seven hearts we've been looking at for the past past three days? Oh, that's eight hearts! Ooh, so close! So close! Just more. We're done with you. Alright. Give a gift to Daddy Dale, see if he, see if he says anything new. I really want to talk him to talk about like his wife, aka Luke's mother, because we don't know much about her. Other than she's not around anymore. Hate that our mountains, ocean, and skies are being polluted. We humans need to live well and be eternally grateful to Mother Nature. Alright, very serious business here. Uh, we got a bunch of flowers for people. There you go, Bo. I need to try to marry him. <laughs> I want to. I gotta see what happens when I get, when I show him the feather. If there's like a little cutscene, or he's just like, that's nice. That's nice blue feather. Maybe I'll try that tomorrow. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do any like other special events other than like maybe the circus, which we've seen already. But there's a new thing that we can do at the circus. I just want to get the boys up to nine hearts and then I can start doing more confessions again and then getting some other girls up to seven hearts and then getting their rival events getting everyone married off in the spring so much excitement all right Barbara I got one orange juice for you I'll have to buy some more later I mean it's not imperative that I befriend her right away when I think about it, like, once I get these people married off, and like, they have rival children running around, Barbara's gonna be a grandma someday, There's, I'm gonna have to befriend the rival child, <laughs> and I could just continue, like, befriending the family members, too. And topping them off. Well, I'll give you my last orange juice. Good afternoon! Are you giving this to me? Why, thank you. I love this. Don't let a failure get your spirits down. If you have the time to mope, then you have the time to get up and try again. Mm. <laughs> Hits me in the heart. I feel like I never, I never read these books, so I just buy them. I'll, I'll get some animal care tool guide. 
book about animal care for experts. I know, I'm, I'm rich. I'm not looking forward to tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow trying to <laughs> process more buckwheat flour. Maybe I'll just do like a minimum, like, I, you know, it's like a regular snowy day. I'll just do my perfect and shiny ones and, and then call it a day. I mean, technically winter, we still have like another week of winter, but who knows. We might not get any more snowy days. <laughs> the game might just be like, that's enough snowy days forever. It's the sun forever now. No more snowy bonus. Since you're so insensitive to these sorts of things, I'll just say it. I like you. Phew. Please always remember that. Oh, that's the present I gave you. <laughs> it suits you well. I have such, such a good eye for these things. It's so pretty. Alright, Mira. Hello. Oh, how nice. I really love this. Thank you very much. What I hate? Let's see. The happiness you thought would last forever suddenly is gone. It's very sad. Okay, yeah, we, we, we remember that line. <laughs> that's, that's like... You know, I was like, I just meant like, what kind of food you hate. Let's not get too deep here. You can get into the abyss of despair now. Okay, Chloe, it's a snowy day, so you are stuck inside. And I have some juice for you. Hey, Chloe, are you excited? You're gonna get... I... I'm taking cousins. You're gonna get a cousin-in-law. <laughs> Kathy's gonna be a new family member. And then you're gonna be a... An aunt. Once removed. I think that's how that works. I don't know. Upgrade your tools at the blacksmith. You get a useful tool and we get paid. Everyone wins. It's almost spring. I bet the animals can't wait for spring either. Right, we're done. Didn't give anything, to Grandpa. Nothing for Grandpa. I could, I could give him something later. Do do. Okay, I am going to. That's not a whistle. <laughs> Yellow, but it's not a whistle. Let's go. Don't need to give anything to Calvin. Even though it would be nice to kind of pat him out. Pat him out to ten hearts. I can do that later. Luckily, with grape cocktails, like... I was thinking about doing Calvin and probably gin last. Because I can give Calvin grape cocktails, which are easy to acquire. And that's like plus 20 points. And then gin, I can give him Pontata Roots. Which are plus 20 points to him. And yeah, that... It, it's just easier to get to maintain them, <laughs> maintain them at a higher heart level, and just the other, the other boys are a little bit more difficult because I only have like plus ten point gifts. All right, selling the pond smelts, even though I could save them, should save them for like spring and summer, so I could like probably win the fish festival, but meh. I don't have the hindsight for that. I don't really need to win that festival either. Uh, okay, put that there. Uh, tomorrow is going to be a buckwheat day, so I gotta replant some more buckwheat. Uh, 150... 250? That's good. I think that's all I need. Yeah. Alright. Um, I'll boil this herb up. Boil, boil, ta-da! And I guess I'll go ahead and make another, another spinach risotto for Luke, because I I still have the recipe stuck in my head. So uh, let's not fail. Let's not fail at this. Some rice, and it's in a pot. Boop boop boop. I hope that's right. <laughs> there we go. Boiling up that rice, making some green rice. Well, let me watch me like be totally wrong about the spinach risotto. Be like it was actually this. Um, Luke, just double checking, being paranoid. 
what I do best. Lukey, Lukey, Luke. You're not Luke. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, where's L? You're K. <laughs> Luke, there we go. Yeah, Spinach Risotto's on that list. Alright, enough. No farting around. Let's go to bed. Another day. Yeah, it feels weird sleeping without saving, but... Another day ahead of us. Alright. This will do a little bit more training, huh, Doug? Pyro, level 3. I'm gonna get you to max soon. <laughs> Unless you act like that. Woo! There we go. And Mr. Tortoise, do your level 2 trick. <laughs> like, it's just funny when you're just like, that much build up. It's just like, what? I don't know what to do. There we go, shake. Do the hokey pokey and shake it all around. I'm gonna give you some attention, hokey pokey. That's not how the song goes. Love for you guys. Pet. pet, pet. Alrighty. Let's check the. Well, of course the weather's gonna be just fine. <laughs> it's the circus tomorrow, so tomorrow should be a beautiful sunny day without a cloud in the sky. No breeze whatsoever. Blah, 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 blah. Um, today is Saturday. I don't have to watch the Sprite Rangers today. I could check out Julius' style check. Haven't just seen him in a bit. Julius' style check. How's it going, everyone? It's time for Julius' style check. My recommendation for today is cat ears and rabbit ears. Ooh, where can I get those? I want, I want some cat ears. They'll give you a cute and playful look. A super cool wig will dramatically change your look. No thanks. I didn't even like the wig. And was there a wig in Tree Tranquility? Either way, I don't like the poofy afro wig. Sometimes it's good to spice things up and wear something different. Enjoy! That's it for today. Enjoy looking fabulous! Julius's, Julius's style check end. No thank you. <laughs> the ears, yes. The afro, no. Alright. Check out our animals. Check out Rob Frost. What do you have inside you, Mr. Snowman? I got a perfect ostrich egg. All right, very nice. I can, I can hatch my own ostrich if I wanted to. <laughs> Perfectly laid by an ostrich or by Rob Frost. Apparently, he lays his own ostrich eggs too. All right, let's deal with these animals. Do 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 do. Bum, bum, bum. I think I was actually gonna save the silk for just, like something later. In case I wanted to go for ultimate title, so let's spin this into thread. Try to speed run this. Go, 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 feed. It, oh no. <laughs> it's, it's happened! I ran out of feed! <laughs> oh, okay, let's. Well. Luckily, this happened on a non-festival Saturday. I'm zero feed. Plenty of fodder, though, thank goodness. I'll just love you guys. And we'll, we'll go to Horde Ranch later today, and we'll, we'll pick some up. No need to panic. Why the heck do... Did I not feed the other chickens yesterday? Am I crazy? They're not sick. It's a time to sell you guys. You're out of production. Time to die. I'll just pet you guys and I'll, I'll be right back. <laughs> With some food. Well, I guess I can just... 
buy everything. I buy a billion stacks. I wonder how many stacks I can buy. Like, how much is too much? When the sky's the limit. Good thing I have fodder for you guys, because it's a little bit more expansive. Do, do, do. Feed, feed, feed. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. For you. Okay, I wonder when the goat's gonna give birth. Watch it be tomorrow. Probably will be tomorrow. What was the last time? Like the 15th? And the 22nd is technically seven days. Just <laughs> since the 15th. Uh, so, yeah, if it's black, we'll keep it. If it's white, we'll sell it. Alright. Need to give you guys some love. No unhappiness allowed. No squiggly marks. Only happiness. I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. <laughs> For some reason, it still counts though as like put the little the little thing above your head, a little music note. Just keep spam talking. Do 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 do. I pet your butt. Do 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 do. I know, guys. We'll be able to go outside tomorrow. It'll be a nice sunny day. No need to be stressed out. Oh, I'm able to ride Billy now. Cool. I could, I, I actually do, can do that like tomorrow or something. <laughs> Cause you're not pregnant. I could actually put you outside and climb you. Brush, brush, brush. Right, milk, milk, milk. Yeah, perfect goat milk. Excellent. Do, 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 do. I don't know what to do with this milk today, so I guess I'll just save it all. Uh, I don't know. What I'm just... hmm, do I want to keep good milk? Good milk seems like a hassle to keep, so I'll just turn it into cheese. I'll sell it. Uh, perfect ostrich egg. Sell the duck egg. You know, just sell. Sell that too. Only keep the perfect stuff. Alright. Those guys are fed. Gotta buy more feed for the chickens. But in the meantime, we gotta wait for the store to open up. Um, let's deal with the buckwheat harvest. Yeah, we got buckwheat to harvest. We got stuff to water. We got seeds to plant. I'll, I'll be right back and all that shenanigans will be done. Okie doke. All done here. I actually had one field that I had to pick, not two. Oops. Uh, I must be getting tired. Alright, so... How much buckwheat did I get? Oops, I blazed past the rucksack a few times. Uh, okay, 29... Perfect 12 shining, and then I guess I could keep the decent and the good for maybe. Maybe we'll get another heavy storm at the end of the season, maybe not. But yeah, I'll process this shenanigans real quick. Get some get some shining buckwheat that I can sell right away. Do 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 where let's start with the Start with the perfect ones, the bigger, the slightly bigger stack. All right, I'll BRB. Okie doke, all done here. Let's sell what we got and yeah, prepare for, prepare for, prepare our gifts <laughs> and then go, and then also go to flute fields. I'm getting kind of tired. <laughs> Am I really gonna do another day like this? 
I'm gonna try. Um, it's kind of lazy. Let's just sell the ostrich egg. Don't really need that. 41 soba flour. And yeah, put everything... Shove everything else... Into my box. What can I put away? Put away the book. Wait. Uh, I don't think I'll need any for tomorrow. Which is good because the store is closed tomorrow. And let me shove as much stuff as I can inside the box and then think about what I actually need. Uh, milk, milk, milk. Put the goat milk there. Shiny milk there. Random buckwheat here and there. <laughs> Alrighty. Right, I'll bring the juice with me. Um, I guess since we are gonna go see Hannah, I'll give her a shiny egg. Got the risotto for Luke. Um, brain. <laughs> brain has to work. You. You and Julius. Alright, I've got the important boys down, which is Luke and Julius. Everyone else is just an extra. Do do. Okay, let's do the important thing. Man, I can't believe, can't believe I ran out of chicken feet. <laughs> I was like, it's, I was like, it's never gonna happen. I'm gonna have chicken feet forever. And I guess I really did have that many chickens that I that they ate through it that quickly. <laughs> do 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 do. Alright, let's not mess around, let's just make a beeline to Horn Ranch. Let's ignore ignore Marimba Farm. Do 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 um Bung. All right, horny ranch. Here, Kane. Got a coconut cocktail for you, and he'll say something else other than the horse races. Rub, 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 rub. Hey. Oh, what's this? You're giving this to me? I love it. I'm so happy. Thanks a lot. There'll be a circus at the church grounds tomorrow. You and I have never raised an elephant or a giraffe before. I mean, it's a different set. Different set of skills. Different knowledge you need for that. So proud of my daughter and Emma, Hannah's. And Hannah's a good, hard-working wife. I think I'm quite a lucky man. You're just busy behind the counter while you're just sipping a coconut cocktail. Alright, rub, 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 rub. Hello. Oh my, is that for me? You're very kind. Thank you. I'm so happy. Tomorrow's the day of the circus. Oh, tomorrow's the day the circus will be at the church grounds. Renee dragged me there once a long time ago. It's nostalgic for me. The most important thing is perseverance. Even if you make mistakes, never give up. Now you're talking just like Barbara. Um, uh, shop. How much feet can I buy? <laughs> How much is too much? Two stacks. Three stacks. Four stacks. Five. I'm assuming the lemon's like nine, 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 six. I think I lost count. Seven. Eight. Nine. Can I keep going? Ten? <laughs> I can keep- I can keep going forever, baby! Alright, this is probably sufficient. <laughs> the final part. One more stack. Alright, do I need anything else? I, d I never need the bell. <laughs> I could buy the bell, but... 
to look at it. It's a useless item though. Herd animals. Like when are you gonna need to herd animals? You have a you have a pretty much a button to do that. Cowbell was added to your help menu. Ring ring ring. Imagine all my cows came in here. It even use the same sound effect as uh as the bell that's outside. <laughs> Yeah, that, yeah that, that seems like plenty of feed. I was expecting the, the bell sound in Magical Melody or it's just like this big ol' clacker. <laughs> and then all the animals get all stressed out when you... when you ring it. They're all like sweating and like, oh god, I gotta go this way. I mean, the sound is very stressful, so... I don't know how these animals just like instinctually go towards the bell sound. Usually, usually need to train your animals for that. Like every time you ring the bell, you give them some like alfalfa hay or something, and they're like, "Oh, food!" Every time that bell rings. All right, guys, consume, consume the feed. Do do. Guys, be all happy. No one's starving, please. Can't afford a sick animal because I don't actually have medicine. <laughs> I don't actually have medicine in my cabinets at all. Do, 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 do. Who has not eaten? You. You still have a fork and spoon. Do, do. Do, do. Last chicken. There, perfect. What? Make sure you get that in your gullet. All right, everyone's happy. Now let's go take a dip in the hot spring, and then we'll take a hike up to Garmin Mines, and we'll fish for a little bit. We just need a few more algae, so it's fine if we only fish for a little bit. Tired. Oops. All right. Yeah, I can't can't whistle up the mountain, so gotta walk it. That sucks. <laughs> I wish a little warp to Garmin Mines with the circus animals. There's one in here. There's something here. Some more herbs. Perfectly obscured by the bushes. Pick up this blackberry. Don't really need those mushrooms, so they can just. They can just rot there for all I care. They're always there if you need them. Mushrooms are very convenient. Especially in the beginning of the game. They're just a little... Some chump change to get you through through the beginning. Do. Do. Alright. Woo. Getting so tired. <laughs> Every, the day is just catching up with me finally. It's been, I just been running off excitement from uh, the, my past few days. Yeah, I've been getting a lot of sleep too during like during the vacation. But as soon as I like, got back home, I was like, I can't sleep. Need to do more exhausting things. Need to go, need to go for a swim or something. All right, well, I'll be right back. It'll be like a second, but. Hopefully I get a few algae. Maybe I'll keep fishing until I get enough algae. <laughs> okay, though, it's after 12 again. I actually caught, I actually caught some crawfish. <laughs> I don't know what was so different. Maybe because I was fishing at like an angle this way. Maybe, maybe there's crawfish on the north side and like only pond smelts on the south side. I also only caught two algae. Um. Is that all I need? <laughs> I don't know. It would suck if I just need one more. I guess it's easy enough to get though. 
<laughs> just go like just go to the witch's hut. Fish outside there. I think from now on though, I'll focus on trying to catch boots. Alright, let's finish the shenanigans. And it's risotto for you. Alright, rub, 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 rub. There you go. Hey! Whoa, really? How'd you know what I liked? Thank you, you made me so happy. You better be. Circus is tomorrow. There'll be animals gathered at the grounds. For some reason, every day feels happy. Just thinking about you makes me feel excited. No, I feel happy. I just want to run around in it. Oh, Luke, you're a child. You're so cute. All right, and then get that bandana bonus. All right, Dale. Let's quickly give this to you. Let's stop talking about pollution. Say something else, please. Do, 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 do. Tomorrow's the circus. Going to start around sundown at the grounds. Come by for free. Alright, blah 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 pollution. Let me give Green Bell flower to Bo. Maybe he'll stop saying about how goodbyes make him make him feel sad. He hates he hates forever goodbyes. There'll be a circus performing at the church grounds tomorrow. I wonder what kind of animals will be there. Alright, something I hate, saying goodbye. When wind and cold come together, sometimes you can see a great frost great frost covered trees. Gotta be careful they don't get too cold. <laughs> this is how you get like cracks in the ground. Like you get some some moisture on the ground, it freezes and then it cracks. That can like destroy your soil too. I don't have anything to give to Barbara, so I'll just, I'll just go say hi to Julius and then go to bed and we'll do the, we'll try to do the circus day. <laughs> we'll, we'll do, we'll do Theodore's request and that will be our accomplishment for today. And this Julius magically gets to nine hearts and then we can, we can do Luke's confession event. That'll, that'll, uh. Get him to that'll certainly get him to what nine hearts that boost the circuses tomorrow. It'll be on the grounds for the church. Since you're insensitive to these sorts of things, I'll just say it. I like you, Foo. Please always remember that. Oh, that's the present I gave you. It suits you well. I have such a good eye for these things. All right, same old, same old. Still at eight, eight hearts. All right, Mira. Rub a rub, rub a dub. Hello. Oh, how nice! I really love this. Thank you very much. The circus is performing on the church grounds tomorrow. What I hate. Let's see. All right. Let's uh, not read this depressing dialogue. Let's move on. Alright, Chloe and then home and then sleep and then farm chores because we're doing so many days at once. Do, 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 do. Chloe! Juice! I'm trying to brain, what am I gonna give you? Rub, 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 rub! Hello! Wow, this is my favorite! I'm so happy, thank you! The circus is tomorrow, they're coming to the church grounds, I can't wait! The greedy tools of the blacksmith, blah blah blah, <laughs> everyone wins. The snow looks fluffy and yummy, but it's not really that yummy. Don't eat the yellow snow, Chloe. Um, actually, I don't think I've talked to Owen. <laughs> like, does I don't even know if he mentions his marriage. Circus, whatever, circus. I'm eating to talk with you, but at the end of the day, we have to part ways. 
Doesn't feel right. You're still romantically involved with me. You just proposed to Kathy. He's still he's still not over me. That's weird. <laughs> You'd think as soon as he proposed to Kathy, he would like revert to friendship dialogue, but he still he still has the romance dialogue. <laughs> he's still into me. Alright, let's go to bed. Super sleepy. Real life, but that does, that's not gonna stop me from doing another day. Let us put away our stuff and then we'll go to sleep. Perfect, perfect 99. <laughs> 99 algae for Ozzy. Right, I guess I'll save. I could I could use a crawfish. I always like have some random need for shrimp. And I was getting low on it anyway. Pond smelt, we go there. I'll just boil up these herbs. Or some more tea. More tea, please. Alright. Um, I guess we'll put away that bell. <laughs> Yay, another useless tool. Let me just put it at the bottom. Never gonna use you. <laughs> Alright, sleepy time. Yep, one more day, I'm gonna try to squeeze it in. <laughs> squeeze in that circus. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Oh, yep, we got a goat. Gabriel, it's born! Oh no. Hurry, come to the barn! Eh, it's black! <laughs> Lucky! Oh! See it open its eyes. Alright, now we just gotta sell this white goat and we can... We can birth us another black goat. We have to sell Toriel. All right, let's give this one a name. What to name this one? Hmm. Tatiana, not Tatiana. Hmm, what do I want to name this one? Actually, let's name this after... After one of my buddies. And wow. <laughs> and I think it's a very fitting name, because... It has the word desk in it, and it's a black goat, so... It's perfect. Duskal. Duskull. I, I think he, he meant his name to to be spelled like Duskull, like the Pokemon, but like that name was taken, so he just like gave a phonetically similar one. So you're just a a dus a duskal gal. Cute! Got another baby goat. Duskal, huh? That's a nice nice name. Can't speak words. Now Duskel is part of the family. Raise it well so I can compete in the animal festival. Yay! So lucky. So lucky I got a little black goat. Alright, circus day. Um, when does the circus start? Oh, three. <laughs> okay, I have to wait till three for Theodore to show up. Okay, I guess I can... I mean, I'm gonna have to hunt for people. Hmm. It's gonna be a little awkward because like people are gonna be flitting in and out of their houses. Uh, I'm gonna need to find Julius and Luke, but I also want to kill enough time for the circus to happen because I don't want to wait around forever. All right. Well, my priority is going to be Luke and Julius, and that's pretty much it. So since everyone else is kinda gonna be kind of going in and out of their houses. Kind of unreliable. Unreliable, just 
see when they're gonna be outside, so I'm not gonna bother with them. I'll just have a rose ready and a spinach risotto. Um, today is Sunday, so let's make sure we watch the Sprite Rangers. <laughs> Don't want to have to go through the whole year again just to watch that. Hello, this is the Rainbow Weather Report. Here's your forecast for tomorrow. It'll be another cold winter day with snow. Will day tomorrow. It'll be slightly windy. All right, give me more snow. Just one day of one day of sun today. All right, time for the Sprite Rangers. Harvest Squadron Sprite Rangers. All right, <laughs> last week's review: Giant Hamel versus Mighty Megami Robo. Oh my god, they're actually freaking <laughs> wrestling. Uh, hmm, this is an easy task. Don't give up! Are you ready for this? The Phantom Sprite special attack! Oh god, <laughs> she has a chest laser! Take this, crop cannon! Space Devil Hamel? Oh, no! Last chapter, peace at last! Don't miss it! So it's the last, last episode. Every week we tell you some hint about a present at the end of the show. Collect all the keywords and get a present! The keyword of this week is T. Don't miss the next week, Sprite Rangers! Harvest Squadron Sprite Rangers end. Alright, watch that! We just have like another month, we have to like watch the beginning again. <laughs> To actually get all the little key letters. Boop. And train you. Do the hokey pokey. All right. Let's get our farm chores done, and then we can. I don't know. Fish some boots. All right, Rob Frost. What do you have for me? Something for the snowman. I got a Hutchin. I'm gonna sell it. I don't need another one. Or I can save it. I should probably save it if I have the space. Sell it in the spring. Alright, eggs. Perfect egg. Good egg. Perfect egg. Alright, lots of perfect eggs. Everyone's sad today. But at least all my chickens laid eggs. Uh, at least they. I wonder why they didn't lay eggs yesterday. Like, did I really forget to feed them? Like, two days prior? I don't remember. Right, feed. Feed the worms. There you go, chickadees. Are you guys just upset that I'm not petting you and carrying you if I, if I deem it not necessary? <laughs> Probably start cutting this out too. It's like the same dealio. Nothing too exciting. Just the same old products. Here. Everyone gets a, every worm gets a pet. You're very hard to get your affection up. I'm probably never gonna see a shining thread come out of you guys before you die. You have very short lifespans. Alright, you've been fed. Does anyone not have a music note over their head? That's all I really care about. Alright, everyone's been loved. There, everyone has a music note. See you later. I'm gonna take care of the livestock. Full barn. But not for long. <laughs> I'm still tempted to sell my cows. But I kinda wanna let them live out their full lives and like watch them die. <laughs> Even though that's kinda sad. But like if they weren't here, then like every time I whistled, it would summon a goat. 
And the goats are faster than the cows. I mean, preferably I would want my horse, but I, I know that's not gonna happen. Dang it! <laughs> Put it in the middle again. Dang nabbit. Alright, everyone has hay in their bellies. <clears throat> Got a bad case of hay belly. Brush, brush, brush. I don't think I need to, like, brush the cows. They're already at full hearts. Brush the goats, though, because... I don't know why, like, sometimes it just doesn't- they don't burst into hearts whenever I talk and pet them. So I'm doing all I can to get as much affection out of you as possible, and, like, sometimes it's not working. I'm almost out of water. I can't believe I drank a whole- a whole flippin' bottle. <laughs> I was drinking water like crazy on, on my trip. It's like we're banging under the sun for a bit. I was like, ugh. Moisture, you need more. And perfect goat milk. Perfect milk. Perfect milk. And I don't think I'm gonna get anything out of you because you just gave birth. Yeah, nothing inside you. Poop. Alright. Let us... Deal with the crops real quick. That'll be a quick job. Well, for you, not for me. <laughs> yeah, these are all flowering. Actually... I'm trying to think. One, one... I have one more... Can I replant these? I wonder if I should buy some flower seeds. Like, after these are done here, if I'm gonna need to... I'm gonna need to buy, like, something that grows a little bit quicker so I can harvest it in time. Anywho, I'll be right back. I'll water the shenanigans. Okie doke. All done here. Guess we'll take a dip in the hot spring. And... Yeah, I... I I still need to grab a few more things from inside my house, actually, before I consider going to the circus. Do. Get all nice and warmed up. Do 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 I am no longer tired. Their energy is back. Alright, plenty of stamina. Plenty of stamina to fish a few fish. I also forgot it is a nice day. I can let my goats out. And my other animals out too. And I can I can ride one of my animals. Woohoo! I can ride my goat! Ah, oh, it's gonna be exciting. Probably gonna end up <laughs> summoning only cows. Um yeah, let me actually track. Let's keep track of one of the boys. Probably Julius. No. I have a feeling Julius is gonna go outside his house. But yeah, just in case, I'm gonna talk to him in the afternoon. Whenever I can find him, just so I don't accidentally activate any confession events. Even though it is technically like a festival day, like I might be still be able to trigger. Kachin. I'll save you. Maybe I'll sell you later. I'll sell. I'll keep the milk. Probably sell the good egg. He's gonna try to keep stacks and stacks of perfect milk. And eggs. Alright, so. Later today, we're going to do. You probably won't even see the circus, because, like, it's the same show every time. We've already seen it, like, three times. <laughs> Technically, once with all the animals. But this time around, since we rescued all the animals, Theodore should have a request event. Similar to like how Thomas, Mayor Thomas, and like the Game Boy Advance 
like Friends of Mineral Town and like the DS games, you would stop by every winter and and ask for an item. Uh, luckily for this, it's a little bit easier. <laughs> like you'll only ask for one of four things. It's not like some randomly generated item that you can acquire in the game or can't acquire in the game, like in the DS version. That was annoying when like Theodore would ask for for a. Uh, like a golden egg. I was like, that's not in the DS game. That was in the Game Boy Advance game. I guess they like coded that in. All right. So out of all the items, he might ask for a rock salt, or he might ask for a spinach. I don't think it matters what quality, so I'll just give him a crappy spinach. He might ask for a chestnut, or probably the hardest item is, or at least the most expensive one, is... I have it somewhere. <laughs> I bought it! <laughs> I had the hindsight to buy this a few days ahead of time. Did I leave it in my toolbox? Alright, yeah. Cheese fondue is the last item we might ask for. So, out of these items, like, depending on what he asks for and what you give him, you'll get a different you'll get a different gem in a turn. So for rock salt, he'll give you an aquamarine. If he asks for a spinach, you'll get a topaz as a reward. A chestnut will give you an emerald. And then cheese fondue will give you a diamond. <laughs> I kind of- I want the diamond. <laughs> I don't know if he'll ask for a cheese fondue though, so. We have everything ready. We, we either grew it or found it. I mean, if you're trying to get this the day of, it might be a little bit difficult. Because none of the stores are open. I mean, you could feasibly maybe find a rock salt in the mines. Spinach, you kind of have to grow it already in the fall. <laughs> and then chestnut, I mean, I didn't grow any chestnut trees, but I bought a ton of chestnuts from Marimba Farm in the fall. And then cheese fondue, we were able to buy that off the ocarina in. Otherwise, you'd have to make it yourself and like, well, that requires like bread. I think like a grape cocktail. And some cheese. Might be a little bit difficult to make the bread and get the grape cocktail if you didn't already know what what you needed. Okie doke. So we got that already set aside. So let's burn a little bit of time until like noonish and kind of see where the boys are. I might go like a little longer if I don't know if none of the boys are coming out of their house. I'll keep a track of Julius though for now and we'll fish until noon. Do sell the good egg. Do, 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 do. Okay. All right, we're gonna fish here. It's like this, I'm gonna fish at the river so I can try to catch some rubber boots. Here be. Okie doke, it's 12 o'clock, and yeah, Julius decided to go to Flute Field, so we're gonna go catch him. Alright, we caught a lovely, a lovely amount of rubber boots. We caught 10 rubber boots, so yay! I also got some extra algae, and some freshwater prawn and crawfish, which counts as shrimp, so cool. I'll have some more, more shrimpy stuff for any shrimp recipes that we have. Alright, let's warp to Flute Fields. Give the rose to, to Julius, and we'll see if Luke is out and about. If he is, then great. If not, then I guess we'll just have to kill some more time by fishing. Fishing again. Do, 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 do. Alright, Julius. Are we gonna get to nine hearts today? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if you'll actually say something else other than the circus dialogue. Rub 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 rub. Rub 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 Hello. Oh my, I love this. I'm so happy. The circus is great. It fills your night with fantastic dreams. My heart is filled with thoughts of you, Gabrielle. 
My love has grown so much, it's overflowing. I've never been so focused on one person. Oh boy, we got him! We got him, boys! We got him to nine hearts. Sunny days feel so good. The climate here is so nice and calm. Alright, just one more look at my scarf and then I can change it. <laughs> I can change my outfit, alright. Alright, yeah, that's... That's definitely nine hearts, yep! Alright, he's like, now committed to one person, yet yeah, we're still flitting around from boy to boy. Uh, Luke is still inside the carpenters. <laughs> Should I do a little bit more fishing? Let's go back to the farm. I don't know, I don't know when he's gonna pop out. <laughs> like, I might just have to go for it. Um, like, as soon as he does come out. Yeah, let me like, let me burn a little bit of time before I like commit to fishing for a little bit longer. Yeah, you might come out at one. Uh, fishing rod. Let me fast forward time. Also, did I not talk to Rob Frost? I did talk to Rob Frost. Yeah, I just forgot. I forgot what I got today. <laughs> Was it an ostrich egg? I don't know. Maybe I'll catch some more rubber boots! Yeah, I'm just... I'll just... I'll just... Swing out a few times till 1pm. Eh? No? Still inside the carpenters. Alright. I'll... I'll BRB and try to catch a few fish. Okay. <laughs> Alright, Luke Luke warped from the carpenters to Fugue Forest. So I guess I guess that's where we're going. We're going to Fugue Forest. That's fine. Alright, um I guess we go to flute fields, I'm not sure what screen he's on in the Fugue Forest. Ah, uh, silly Billy. At least he's outside. <laughs> At least we could find him. Like, why can't you just hang outside your your house for like a bit? Don't go warping on me. He knows some warp songs. And of course, I summon a cow. Oh. I can't ride my goat today, I guess. All right, Lukey boy. What screen are you on? Watch him be in the last one. <laughs> I was like, I could have just warped to the witch's house and and gone from there. Um, luckily, none of the path is blocked by trees. Please keep it that way. And please don't warp away. I'll be very sad. There he is. First, first clearing. Alright, I got the spinach risotto for you. Yeah, that would be amazing if you get to nine hearts as well, but... <laughs> I mean, I am giving you spinach risotto, which is one of your faves, but... Hey! Whoa, really? How did you know what I liked? Thank you, you made me so happy! I wanna go play with the animals at the circus. I'm looking forward to it. I don't think you're allowed to do that. For some reason, every day feels happy. Just thinking about you makes me feel excited. Alright, well, still... Still at 8, but I think next episode we'll do a confession event with Luke, and that should boost him up to 9, and we'll be done with him. And we can, yeah, start knocking out each boy one at a time, one day at a time. That'll be great, and we can, we can get them married off. Finally! More events! All right, let's just deal with Theodore and then I'll call it a day. I need to take a break. I need to do my laundry. <laughs> I need to get all my laundry out of my suitcase and wash my clothes. And I need to shower after work. Um, let's go to Harmonica Town. Everything needs to be cleaned up. I'm so glad before I left for the trip that I like cleaned my room and like put on fresh sheets 
Just so, like, when I crawled into bed, I had... Everything was just clean and fresh. I didn't have, like, a dirty bed. Alright, it's 3 p.m., I think. If I can tell military time. Alright, I hope this works. I, like, kind of forgot how Theodore's... Theodore's request goes if I just hand in the item, or... Oh, it's a cutscene. Ahem. Theodore's Sickness of Wonder is about to begin. I hope you will enjoy the fantastical feats you will see shortly. When it's showtime, simply knock on the door of our circus. See you then. I'm not gonna bother with the show, I just want to talk with you. Alright, hello. Oh god, the pig sound. Oink. Gabriel. And out of the dinner that Orson the pig usually eats. That's his name, Orson? <laughs> Can you give me some cheese fondue? That's exactly what I wanted to give you. I have it. Alright, so you just have to select it out of your bag. And if you don't have it, then just tough look, I guess. Alright, excellent. That's that's actually really perfect because I wanted I wanted the diamond for the end of the year. <laughs> Thank you very much. I think Orson will be quite satisfied with this. I'm very happy. Please take this as a thanks. You got a diamond, a very very valuable gem. All right, and this request event will like repeat every year, or not every year, every month when he arrives by the circus. This is not exclusively winter, but yeah, we got. We got the hardest request, but we got the most expensive gem out of it, so I'm glad. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely need this diamond for one of the end of the year competitions, and I didn't really want to go back. I didn't want to dig up any more white wonderfuls. I'm done with that life. Alright, Orson, now that I know your name, let's go wee 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 all the way back home. Did everything I needed to do today. Let's put the animals back inside. I want to forget that or else I'm not going to get any eggs tomorrow. Oh, cow out. Everyone in. Alright. Try to double check what's in my head. Yeah, be be befriended... Befriended Julius and Luke. Saw the Sprite Rangers. Yeah, that's all I really needed to do today. Alright. Let's put my stuff away. Gotta grab some more water. <laughs> to quench my thirst and then deal with all my chores. My real life chores. Alright, we got a freshwater prawn. Do we have a stack of these? I don't think I do. I'll make a new one, I guess. Make a new stack. Got more crawfish. Um, spinach? I guess I could preemptively make the spinach risotto for tomorrow. That's probably all Luke is gonna need. And then we gotta start befriending the girls. <laughs> I've been kinda holding back on all the girls, so... Gonna need to play some ketchup. Alright, yeah. Rice, spinach, onion, go. This will probably be the last risotto I give him. That's all you'll need. A diamond, I'll save it. Let's put it up here for now, front and center. Um, I'll we'll take out a goat miracle potion and just kind of remind myself that I need to sell my, one of my goats to reimpregnate it. Reimpregnate a new one. Um, yeah, I guess I'll keep the algae. Rock salt. Where is my rock salt? Rock salt, rock salt. It looks like a rock. There it is. Chestnuts can <laughs> go back there. Alright, I hope I didn't forget anything. Um, let's... Okay, let's save. <laughs> hey, once I'm done with Luke, I don't need to wear this bandana anymore. <laughs> I can... Wear something else. I won't be concerned about affection bonuses. Save over file three. 
Got through day 22. That makes me happy. Alrighty. I hope you guys had a relaxing time. And I'll see you in the next episode. Oh, bye-bye.